What's up, what's up guys? In today's video, we will be exploring the Denali National Park and Preserve here. And this is about four hours away from Anchorage and then two hours away from Fairbanks. So if you're driving in a car, you can only go up to mile 15, but if you get on a tour bus, you'll stop at mile 62. <laughs> Okay guys, so right ahead, that's the bus that we're taking to tour the park. We'll go up to mile 62.5. So this is the first rest stop. We start at 6.40, so pretty early. It's just so damn expensive for the tourists though, but yeah, here we are. So this is the Takuna River. So we're trying to, we're, we are hoping to get a view of the Denali mountain. So it's a very slim chance right now. It's pretty cloudy during the summer, but wish us luck. And hopefully we can see more bears or we've seen a bunch of moose and birds, but hopefully we can see bears. Alrighty. Close up caribou. What's going on? Sorry, noise. Getting the snow. Yes. Yeah. Snow. The big pile of gravel out there that they've scraped off the road. Oh, there's another one further on down. Okay. <laughs> enjoy, enjoy. Stay there. Now get your photo. We got another bus waiting for us out there. Oh my God! Look at this. We'll let them have the space. You can get a so full view of the antlers. Too. Get your last photo, and we'll move <laughs> on. This is mile 33, so we got a few more to go. <laughs> so right now it's 11.20, we got another like about three hours to go. Hiking the polychrome path, guys. <laughs> Remy's surviving so far. Nice view from here. All right, I'm scared, guys. I'm scared of heights, but you still gotta do it anyway. <laughs> Always once in a lifetime. <laughs> nothing. I don't really get to hike Denali that often. It's nothing. It's all flat. What do you mean? Oh my god. Yeah, that was scary. Scary cat. <laughs> scary cat. We gotta do it at least once. What do you think of the view, Ram? Did you come back to Denali again? Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Uh, and came out. Uh, no thanks. <laughs> That's why we have the largest and hotels available with the National Park, guys. <laughs> okay, guys, here are some of the wildflowers. Very small, but still pretty. And don't take this home. Okay guys, welcome to the Denali Feather Center here. So we just completed our tour this morning. So just gonna go walk around Feather Center, see what they have to offer here. But I believe most of the places are closed due to COVID. Okay guys, right behind me is the gift shop. So that's the only building that you can walk through actually because everything else pretty much 
close. They're open at a distance. So, okay, let's see what they have here. Okay guys, right ahead of me is the actual visitor center where you can get information from the park rangers, but of course that's a distance. Savage Alpine Trail, four miles, one way. Eight miles. Lots of hiking trail here, but... Unfortunately, we can't go to Wonder Lake today because they just basically closed for the season. That's the end of our Alaskan adventure here. Tired. Oh, God. So we got here on Friday from Seattle. So it took us about five days and four nights here total. So, you know, we did the tour of Anchorage and the Seward, looking at Kenai Fjords. And then yesterday we went to Wrangell St. Elias National Park and drove through the unpaved uh, Denali Highway. And today we went to Denali, just finished with our tour here, gonna drive back to Anchorage and fly back to LA for two days and then going back home in DC. So in this eight days, we really pack a lot of things. Lots of driving. Which I'm is hungry now. Remy's favorite habit. So hopefully that's how gonna be good. All right, we're gonna go eat lunch before heading back to Anchorage. What do you have, Rem? Pot thai. I'm be having shrimp sure. pot thai and I have the towel we'll pass you. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hit like and subscribe. Can't wait to share more adventures with you guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.